optical sensors. Uh, a unique thing is uh, Will has polarized the green light so that uh, he could easily distinguish that from room light as if the greenness wasn't enough. And ready when the timer is ready, sir. Ready. All right. Here we go. Oh, wow. Oh, there we go. We got it. That was interesting. 3.99. 3.99. 3.99. Display says so very lost. <laughs> so. All right. Next round. So Ted is using computer vision uh, and uh, kind of a neat, neat new cool thing, uh, Pixie Cam, correct? Uh, which is a sort of a, a one of the evolutions of this old CMU cam. I'm thinking he's looking for green and orange. Yeah, which one green and orange? Yeah, anybody in the crowd with, with green and orange stripes, run. Oh. That's, how, that's what happens when you don't put it on the back as well. Ah. Oh, it can't see it because it's in the dark. So. Ah, okay. Okay. I'm going to need another run for that one. So, computer. All right. Oh, uh, this is the first uh, a FTC hot Lego tracker. All right. Uh, that's the orientation? Yes, sir. All right. Good for you. Come on. Oh. All right. A little bit of uh, dancing, but uh, got to the goal, so that's good. 5.92. 5.92. Mulligan on that. All right. And uh, so time starts as soon as the robot begins moving. Uh, now I really am stuck on the carpet. I can tell that's what's uh, going on. Here. Okay. So yeah, I don't realize the mulligan was worthwhile. <laughs> but uh, help at all at this point. But I had to nudge it to get it started here. Look, look, yeah, we'll talk. We'll keep this time. We'll keep this time. Boom. All right. There are some disadvantages to smaller and lighter. This is PS25. So it does a five second delay on start, and it's caught, it's caught too. I can tell, well, no, something else is going on there. All right. All right. Excellent. 
Alabama. Okay, we're yeah. on.